Hey guys, welcome to my second tutorial. I am Blender in the Sky and today I will show you how to create this landscape you can see over here in the Blender game engine. So let's get started. In this first part we will focus on modeling our landscape and to begin we will delete our basic cube and add in a plane. We will then scale it up and subdivide it a lot of times. We will repeat this process as often as we need until we have a high-res mesh. The next step is to sculpt our landscape. We will do this by using the clay strips brush and give it the shape we want it to have. You can use the clay brush to smooth out some of the shapes you created. Try to leave your landscape as flat as possible as it will be easier to work with later. After sculpting this awesome terrain we will now have to add in a texture. So we will create a new material and also add in a new texture in the textures panel. You can use any texture you want but I prefer to use a sand texture for this terrain. When we switch to texture view mode to see our texture we also change to GLSL in the shading menu. Also, we have to set our lamp as a hemisphere. Now change the mapping mode to UV and add a new UV map. Open up a new window and change it to the UV image editor. You can see my UVs are a little bit stretched, but we can fix that easily by unwrapping it again with project from view. Now we have a nice UV map of our terrain. Scale up your UVs as much as needed until your texture is very small. It's important to have a tileable texture, otherwise you will get problems when scaling it up. To finish this off we will add normals to our texture and change the bump space to texture space. We then decrease the influence of the normals to make it look more believable. We also change the specular intensity to make it look like a sand material. And there you have it, your basic terrain for the game. In the next episode we will check out how to create the foliage, the trees, stones and grass to create our final landscape. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial, be sure to subscribe to my channel and see you next time.